Hello everyone, welcome back. So guys, in our previous session, we have discussed about how we can deal with the null values in our data. Suppose if we have duplicate values, how we can deal with our duplicate values in our data? Let's understand that. To deal with our duplicate values, first of all, you can choose any column, not gender, because definitely there will be duplicate values in the gender. If I suppose choose full name, okay. Here, if I go to the data tab and uh, if I click on remove duplicates, okay, now it tells us that uh, you want to remove duplicates from all these columns. So suppose if we have a duplicate value in this column, in respect to that, do you want to remove the data of all the rows? So if I click on okay, it will remove four duplicate values for me, okay, but it is not the correct approach. So if I press Ctrl Z, it won't be a correct approach. Why? Because let's say, uh, so here we have a name, Joshua Gupta. Okay, Joshua Gupta is 23 years old, is a male and has this salary. Again, we have this name, Joshua, Joshua Gupta, who's 29 years old, male and his salary is also mentioned over here. Okay, now these are two different people. So never delete the data based on name, age, gender, salary, department or anything. Okay, always make sure when you're removing the duplicate values, just choose employee ID. So if you click on employee ID and now if I click on remove duplicates and again, if I click on OK, it would remove the duplicate values from uh, for me based on the IDs. Okay, so this is how this works. Always make sure that uh, from which column we are trying to remove the duplicate values and never just remove duplicate from gender. Just remove duplicates from the employee ID. This is for table. It is fine. But when it comes to the range as well. So suppose if I would have had the range. Okay, so I'm just taking the same data in a new range. It's not a table anymore. It looks like a table, but it's not a table. So if I go to home and if I go to clear, clear formats, it will remove the formats. It's just a range, but not a table. If I choose this, if you can choose the range as well. We can go to data tab again. And in the data tab, we have removed duplicates. If we click on this, this is just one column that it is removing its data from. Click on OK. And now three duplicate data will be removed from here. So just make sure if you're choosing a range, then all, then it's fine that you can choose a particular column and remove the data. If you're choosing a table, so suppose this table is there. If you're choosing a table, make sure you remove the data using the employee ID. Okay, and it will remove the data from the whole table based on employee IDs. So this is how you can remove the data when uh, it comes to cleaning the duplicate data. Because of the duplicate data, there can be a mismatch in the exact values of let's say sales or salaries or even the mean values or even the count of the data changes when there are duplicate values. So it is very important to remove the duplicate values from your data. And this is how you can do it in Excel. I hope after this session, it is clear how we can remove the duplicates. In our next session, we will be talking about how we can remove white spaces from our data. So stay connected guys and I'll see you in the next session.